Yes, sir. Welcome back to the Dropping Dimes podcast, Daily Dime series. This is now episode 24. And for today's episode, we have the box versus the Mavs. Yes, sir. Luka Magic versus Giannis. And then, of course, we have integrated here for today's episode, our Crunch Dime segment. Yes, we'll be talking about all the latest news, including what's up with Carl Anthony Towns. And of course, we still have the top five plays of the night. The Dropping Dimes podcast starts right about now. Yes, sir. Welcome back, Dimers. Again, if you are into basketball and if you love the NBA, then this is the channel for you. So please subscribe and hit on the notification bell so that you can follow all the episodes of the Dropping Dimes podcast by J.I. Dimes. Feel free to also share the video, leave a comment, and smash on the like button. Okay, so we're now here at episode 24 of the Daily Dime series. Again, you can follow us on Facebook. You can follow us also on Instagram. You can catch uh, the episodes there. Of course, uh, the links are in the description. You can also follow us on Twitter, Pinterest, Spotify, and Anchor. So let's kick off the episode with a travel back in dime. Not that one. There you go. So for our travel back in time, so we have the late, great Clifford Robinson. Yes, sir. So on this date, January 16, 2000, Clifford Robinson, when he was still playing for the Phoenix Tun, scored 50 points in a 113-100 win over the Denver Nuggets, what a game for the late, great Clifford Robinson. May his soul rest in peace. So let's now proceed to our Spin and Dime segment. Okay, so for our Spin and Dime segment, again, this is brought to us by at Sports Daily News. Please follow him on Instagram at sports underscore daily news underscore. Let's start with the Bulls and the Thunder. Thunder winning it by 2, 127 to 125. And then we have the Utah Jazz winning against the Atlanta Hawks, who are really struggling, 116 to 92. Hawks are now below 500. And of course, the big game, Giannis versus Luka. Bucks winning by 3, 112 to 109. Another great game between the Cavs and the Knicks. Avs escaping with a 106-103 win over the New York Knicks. And then the Boston Celtics, even without Jason Tatum blowing out the struggling Orlando Magic, 124-97. And then LeBron James and the Lakers winning over the New Orleans Pelicans. And then, of course, the Clippers blowing out the Kings, 138-2. 100. So let's now proceed to our first featured game. Our first featured game is the Bucks versus the Mavs. Look at Giannis attacking. Oh, look at the stretch. How the hell can you stop that? The two time MVP imposing his will and thus. So the Bucks winning 112 to 109. Giannis led away with 31, 9, and 2. Chris Middleton, what a what a game as well for Chris Middleton. 25 points, 8 boards, and 6 times. Drew Holiday had 16 points, 3 boards, 5 assists. While Luka Magic had 29, 9, and 13. Tim Hardaway Jr. had 22 and 6. And Chris Tops Porzingis had 15, 10, and 1. Yes, for the second feature game, it was all about this man, Andre Drummond. Yeah, he was 
beast in all game long. So the Cavs winning against the Knicks 106 to 103. Andre Drummond 33 points, 23 rebounds, and three dimes, while Chetty Osman had 25 points, three boards, five assists. Larry Nance Jr. 14 points, 9 boards, and 5 assists. Julius Randle continues to ball with 28, 6, and 6. Emmanuel quickly as well. How about 23 points, 5 boards, and 4 dimes? And RJ Barrett had 20 points, 4 boards, and 3 dimes. Let's go to our third featured game. <laughs> Yes, sir. So for our third featured game, and it's all about this guy. No, not really him, but the team, the Thunder. Yes, Darius Baisley did contribute as the Thunder defeated the Chicago Bulls 127 to 125. It was actually Shea Gilgis Alexander who led the way again with 33 points, 5 boards, and 10 dimes. Lou Dort had 21 and 8 and Kendrick Williams had 14 5 and 2 for the Bulls Zach Levine continues to ball 35 7 and 6 while Kobe White had 22 9 and 7 Wendell Carter Jr. had 16 points 11 boards and two dimes let's now go to our final featured game for the episode and of course it is oh my oh my goodness jeff teague it's cooling the rookie cole anthony let's see that one more time oh my there you go anthony back to new york after that crossover the Celtics took care of business even without Jason Tatum, 124 to 97. Jalen Brown led the way with 21 to an eight. Jeff Teague, what a luxury to have him as a backup point guard. 17, one and two. And then Peyton Pritchard playing like he's a five-year vet. Oh my goodness, doesn't really play like a rookie. 16, four and three. Oh, Anthony had a good game, 15-6-3. Aaron, Aaron Gordon had 17-2-3, while Nick Vucevic, or Vucevic had 15-6-4. So those are, again, all the games for today. And that is it for the Spin and Dime segment. Thank you again to Sports Daily News for all the updates and the scores. Let's now proceed to our what time is it? It's crunch time. Two minutes starts now. Now for the crunch time. Our two minutes starts now. Brooklyn Net star Kyrie Irving has been fined 50000 by the NBA for violating health and safety protocols. The Washington Wizards are now up to uh, five players who have tested positive for coronavirus. The Minnesota Timberwolves have also announced that Carl Anthony Towns has tested positive for the coronavirus and thus the NBA and NBPA are discussing um, other ways on how to remedy the problem and that is through adding an additional roster spot through the two-way contract and then Yusuf Nurkic will undergo surgery because of the fractured, fractured hand uh, that he injured yesterday and he will be out indefinitely so that is it for our crunch time series our crunch time segment rather integrated into the daily dime series for today so let's now go to the top plays of the night okay so as always this is my favorite segment the top plays of the night let's now go to number five at number five who do we have at number five it's this guy luca magic look at that making it always look too easy for luka magic unfortunately they lost to the box by three let's now go to number four at number four of course Giannis, the mvp oh man mvp versus the most likely mvp Giannis, big time and of course this brother Thanasis, loving it now let's go to number three at number three who do we have Oh, Nerlens Noel! 
Dibs will surely love that. Look at that. That is what you call giving everything, whatever it takes. And how about that block on Javel McGee? Tough fall. Don't worry. He's okay. What a block by Nerlens. Let's go to number two. At number two, we have... Oh, it was declared as the play of the game because look at this. How about Taco Fall putting it on the floor and the jam. Oh, and the bench. Oh, look at the Celtics bench. How can you not go crazy? Oh, my goodness. Taco Fall. Let's see that one more time. Seven, six. Oh, my goodness. And look at the celebration. Let's now go to number one. But for me, this is still the best play of the night. Look at this. Taco for three. Oh, and the back is open on a Saturday. Yes, sir. Taco fall. Oh, my goodness. The bank is open for taco oh my g and those are the top plays of the night Paganyan uwi ana mga bro okay let's now proceed to this one okay so for our special shout outs for today again special shout out to poor po yes sir ang ganda ng music and of course matic shout out to, to one of my former students Probably one of the grittiest that I've ever met. Bidim na bidim ako sa batang yan. Ibang klase ang, ang perseverance, no? And I'm wishing him all the best. Jeremy Chu. Yes, sir. Special shout out yan. Matik yan. But may Jeremy, one of the top supporters of the podcast. And of course, poor po by Sir Banjo Hoson and Mamimi Hoson. Please follow. Grabe, ang ganda na music. Automatic. Download na yan sa playlist sa Spotify. Okay, so let's now proceed to this one. So again, if you love basketball and if you love the NBA, this is the channel for you, the Dropping Dimes Podcast by J.I. Dimes. So please subscribe and hit on the notification bell so that you can follow all the episodes of the podcast. Yes, sir. And then please feel free to share the video, leave a comment, and smash on that like button. So again, this is the 24th episode of the Daily Time series. Maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat na nag-subscribe, sa lahat po na nag-susupport sa podcast. Once again, this is J.I. Dime saying, Basta kay Taco, mafofol ka talaga. Yes, sir. It keeps safe, everyone.